This is a time lapse video of our 13 year old, approximately 50 pound female cicada tortoise, Claudine. Here you see her re entering a burrow that she dug in uh, about two years ago. Uh, we were away on vacation, it was hot. Um, my niece actually found it. She couldn't find Claudine and actually fell in the hole. <laughs> so we didn't let Claudine in the tunnel last year because it was kind of cold. It was a cold summer last year. It's hot again this year, so we let her in. But during those two years, uh, the tunnel kind of closed up. I tried to keep the sand and the rain out of it. But uh, basically, it shrunk down to like an eight-inch diameter, you know, with the sand washing in. Uh, rain washing is actually what they want in the desert. You'll notice she'll come out and she'll look around. What she's doing is, first of all, she's trying to make sure that nothing's watching her dig this burrow. So until she gets to the safe depths, you'll see her do that a lot. She's also looking at the shape of the mound up above the surface so that, you know, in the desert, when it rains, so they do want water to go down there. They do want water to flood the tunnel so that it absorbs into the soil and they've got like latent moisture to absorb through their skin for the rest of the year. So it gets about 65 degrees in the tunnel. It's a little bit cool for sulcata tortoise. However, sulcatas don't have acid digestion. They have bacteria and enzymes. So basically, uh, they're compost piles. They eat, and that digestion process creates heat. So that when she eats during the day, she brings a little heater down at night. So if she stays in the 70s, and she's, she's fine. Uh, plus, she suns and heats up. And what I'm going to do is go ahead and make some more videos as she goes on and also drive a little car down through there like I did two years ago and show you what it looks like in the tunnel.